Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Hikaru Nakamura and Wesley. So, this is a game from your next move, Rapid Chess Tournament, played in Belgium in 2018. Hikaru Nakamura had white pieces and he started with d4. Wesley so played knight to f6, bishop to b4, perhaps going for the London system d5, e3, c5, white to move, d takes on c5 was played, c3, and knight to f3 were the two most played moves, d takes on c5, e6, defending the pawn, attacking the defender of the pawn on c5, c3, this looks like queen's gambit reversed, doesn't it? Black to move, bishop to d7 was played. If knight to c6, then white may play bishop to b5 or even queen to a4. Bishop to d7, queen to b3, a takes on b4, c takes on b4, b6, white to move. Bishop to d6 was played. If c takes on b6, then queen takes on b6. The pawn on b4 is under pressure. If a3, then bishop takes on b4 check, and after a takes on b4, rook takes rook. What else? In this position, if b5 is played, then queen to a5 check, and after knight to d2, bishop to b4. Again, black is better. Back to our game. Bishop to d6. Black to move. In this position, Wesley so played knight to e4. Very nice move. Hikaru Nakamura played queen to b2. Of course, he considered bishop takes on f8. If bishop takes on f8, black would not take the bishop immediately. Queen to f6 is the best move. With a double attack. After f3, rook takes on f8. White must take the knight, and then queen takes rook. Black is better, much better. Back to our game. Queen to b2. Knight takes on d6. C takes on d6. Black to move. Queen to f6 was played. Offering to exchange queens. Queen takes queen. Pawn takes queen. b5. Preventing knight to c6 and knight to a6. Bishop takes on d6. Material is equal. But black's position is better. Black is a bishop pair, better activity to the pieces. White pawn on a2 is under pressure. White has two pawns against one white pawn in the center. The game continued. a4, king to e7, bishop to d3. Is this attacking the pawn on h7? Rook to c8, knight to e2. If bishop takes on h7, f5 trapping the bishop so we have knight to e2 e5 f3 f5 rook to a2 bishop to e6 threatening d4 rook to c2 bishop to b4 check king to f1 rook takes on a4 black is a pawn up in a better position rook takes on c8 bishop takes on c8 white to move. In a difficult position, Nakamura played a bad move. Knight from e to c3. Better was king to f2. What's wrong with this move? How should black continue? Wesley so played. Bishop takes on c3. And after knight takes on c3, rook to a3 attacking the knight and exiting the bishop on d3. Knight takes on d5 check, king to d6. Knight takes on b6, attacking the bishop, bishop to e6, saving the bishop on d3, bishop to b1, but now king to c5, trapping the knight. Perhaps in a classical game, white would resign in this position. The game continued. Knight to c8, bishop takes on c8, king to f2, bishop to e6, g4, f takes on g4, Bishop takes on h7, knight to d7, 
rook to b1, rook to a2, check, king to g3, g takes on f3, h4, f5, king takes on f3, black to move. Black played a move and white resigned. What is the move? Wesley so played a knight to f6, attacking the bishop. Nakamura resigned. One line goes like this. Bishop to g6. And now knight to e4. Threatening check mate. Rook to f2. Check mate. What can white do about this? He can give few checks. Rook to c1. Check. King to d6. Rook to d1. Check. King to e7. And now if white wants to defend f2 square, black can play immediately. Knight to d2, or first rook to h2, threatening to capture the pawn on h4, maybe. And after say h5, knight to d2, check. And after king to g3, what else? Then knight takes on f1, check. And I guess we can stop here. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.